at home with the caddies. Ah, Anna, good morning, love. I'm cooking you my world famous Captain Caddy breakfast, guaranteed to set you up for a busy day. Morning, Dad. Morning, Mum. Morning, Si. Yeah. Mum. Yep, please. Anna. Only if it's quick, otherwise, I'll miss my bus. And I really don't want to have Grandad take me again. He's so slow. It's super embarrassing. Excuse me, little miss. I can still kick up a pretty quick pace compared to you feet draggers on your not so smart phones. And don't you forget it. Right, my lovelies, my amazing breakfast is almost ready. Jamie Oliver could not do any better, I tell you. Anna. Be my super sous chef and have a tidy up whilst I put together these last few touches. Dad! Oh, you've thrown away all these veg peelings and the bacon rind. Don't you know you should recycle them? Just because we're not going to eat the scraps doesn't mean they can't be disposed of properly. They can be composted. No, no, no. Listen here. You can't recycle bacon and meat. It's not safe. Oh, Dad, you know nothing. Check this out on my not-so-smartphone. You see, we have our own caddy for the kitchen. All you have to do is put in all your food waste and then empty it into the food recycling bin, ready for collection each week. If everyone recycled their food scraps, then it would reduce CO2 in the air. That sounds great, hun. But even with meat bits, we'd still have to be careful with bones. Like from our Sunday roasts. Actually, Mum, the composting facility will take bones as well as the meat, tea bags, pretty much everything. They put it in an epic shredder, which mushes down all the waste. All of the natural gases keep the mush at approximately 70 degrees Celsius, which kills any harmful microbes. Then four months later, boom, compost. Oh, really? What happens to it then? Anna, you better get your gloves on and start digging out that bin. <laughs> Yeah, right. You can clear up your own mess. And, for your information, the finished compost all goes back to local Kent farmers who grow our food in the first place. Well, everyone, it's time Noodles and I popped out for a breath of fresh air. Could you take the caddy out as you go, please, Grandad? Exactly, Mum. It's so easy. No mess, no fuss. I'll be passing the bins. Roger that. Come on, Noodles. I haven't got all day. There. The kid is right. No mess, no fuss. 